this spread. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. This is Speaking Spread. Episode 98. I beat you. The freaking podcast, the man. The podcast. The podcast, the one and only. We don't have our sign up because I think we lost it oh, somewhere, I it bro. In my house. I forgot about that. Loki, yeah, I think. Right, sorry. I think stuff's been getting thiefed from the cabin, bro. We we missing a thing or two around. Gotta get security. Gotta get a watchdog. Barry's not doing his job. Oh, we don't pay him because his, his, his eyes are covered by the hat, anything, bro. That's bro. true. Thinks he's, his thinks he's hood. <laughs> Come on, Barry. <laughs> no, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, check out our Instagram and TikTok. Speaking sporadically, you can listen to us on all platforms if you want. So Spotify and stuff like that too. Go down um, and like and subscribe right now. Turn on the notification, bro, because we're bringing this energy every freaking week. Episode 100. Be on the lookout. <clears throat> that one was awesome. Live audience, a lot of cool if stuff. That's up. Just go watch it, bro. Just watch it. Absolutely. All right. All right. So if you came from a continuation of episode 97, we got you right here. Why are you like <laughs> a different person? You're like, come on, guys. I'm sorry. Sorry. Bro, it's, just, it's just throwing me off. A I just bit. had a realization the other day, you know? Like, I just realized that like, I'm a YouTuber. You have schizophrenia? Yeah. Well, that too. Well, someone once, once someone told me that being mentally stable is not optimal for gains in the gym. You got to lose a little bit of control. Let go a little bit. You are. Who said that? A normal influx of hormones does not fix the macros. <laughs> Manic Mike. Fix your pot filter. That's throwing me off, too. I like Bro, it. Bro, just, just go, go on the internet and watch thug. and look up Manic Mike best, best quotes. <clears throat> Man, is crazy. I believe it. I'm <clears throat> convinced that if I had like a GoPro strapped to me my entire life, 90% no one of the would clippable watch it. moments would be with you in front of it, dude. I hope so. That's an I mean, interesting life, bro. No, it's, it's it'd be like an Adam Sandler comedy is one to try to get at. That's kind of a I mean, dub. I, is I, a I, dub. I definitely it's take dub, that as a dub, bro. It's a dub. Sort of. Because I like thinking about, like, me, the past two weeks I have kind of been off my rocker. You know? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah I know. Dude, the rocker's been on you. <laughs> <laughs> You've been tripping balls, bro. I, know. I mean, we shouldn't even say some of the stuff I've seen you do. It's, it's no. been wild. Literally That's illegal. That's for sure, dude. Illegal. Anyway, <laughs> we're going to keep talking about Big easy. Uh, school stories because during the break, we were still just hammering them. And ham- well, not break. I guess it's a new episode. But we were just keep hammering these stories, and they were hilarious. And like, I was like, yo, I could talk about this for hours, so we're just going to keep it rolling. Should we re-say the one? <laughs> I think you should. Re-say it was so good. good. You guys got to react again. I know. That's the worst part. It's of like, course, I'm going to try, but and I'm going to laugh. I don't know how, bro. I forgot this for so long, but this, I'm not going to say any names, right? But this memory pops into my head. And so there's this, like, kid I don't talk to very much. Like, nothing against the man, but I just don't talk to him very much. And this is, like, third or fourth grade, bro. So I'm chilling, playing basketball with, like, just chilling on how our, how our playground's built. Like, there's a big basketball court here. Then there's a big middle sidewalk. And all the teachers stand on the middle sidewalk. <laughs> and this kid comes up to me. And like I said, he doesn't talk to me very often. So he's like, Ayo, Jacob. <laughs> hey, get a look at this, my guy. And I'm like, what in the hell? I see this man do the goofiest run, load his kicking leg up. I think he taps himself in the butt, launches this kickball. And I'm like, where is he hitting that to? And one of our teachers, out of nowhere, bro, she got bonked in the head so freaking hard, dropped her, bro. And I just hear her go, son of a bitch. <laughs> I'm weak. And she turns, obviously turns from the direction it looks. The kid that kicked the ball is sprinting. He's running away. And she looks at me, and I'm like, I point at him, bro. I had no option, dude. I thought I was going to get sent. <laughs> I didn't know I she dropped. No, nah, she didn't really, like, drop to the ground, like, right? Like, stumbled, though. Or, like, stumbled a little bit and then did that little, like, thing where you, like, bend over and you recoup yourself and you're, you, you're like, sure get, get your bearings back for a second. You, uh, <laughs> that is hilarious. I was like, mercy. Do you remember? <laughs> yeah, I love how he's already running I'm away like, when she turns. <laughs> I don't want to laugh at it, but do you remember, on the topic of dropping, bro, do you remember... Back when you had glasses, like fifth grade, we were playing. Uh, we used to play just like straight up ball tag all the time, like two or three people. And you were on. We had the so it was a we had a really nice place that I, I think like at the school. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but great it was a set of it was a rainbow, an arc, like a big rainbow, like probably like two like twelve feet tall at its arc at top of the arc, and it was just made up of rings. I don't know why they trusted kids. Like, why, why do people make them like? Anyways, it was tall. You just like climb through the rings and you go to the next one, go to the next one, go to the next one. And you'd go back down, and that's just what it was. You tried to escape me, because I was it with the ball, on top of the rings. And you're like, you'll never get me here. And I feel so horribly bad about it to this day. But I can see it so vividly in my mind, bro. I absolutely threw a heater. And I did not try to hit you in the face. 
I did not try to knock your glasses off your face. I also did not try to knock you 12 feet onto the ground. <laughs> but do you remember this? Dude, I don't. <laughs> hit his head. I kind of remember that. You didn't I talk remember, to me for like two weeks, remember, and I'm like, well deserved. Remember the cargo? <laughs> remember the cargo net one? And then there's that big ring, so that's what we're talking about. I'm climbing up the cargo net. Oh, maybe you're on the cargo net. I try to make the. I think this is a different occasion, but I okay. try to make the jump and I like grab it, but my hands don't like hold me. So my body falls like this and I'm horizontal. And I was six foot dropped to the ground, lost my breath so hard. I was like, just for five minutes, just sitting there, unable to breathe. Those are the oh. worst. You oh, remind me. The you know, the, they're pretty famous, like the pyramids, the, the rope pyramids yeah, yeah, that you can climb all over. We used so, to jump off the top. For some stuff. reason, just my class was out there like not even my grade like literally i think my homeroom class we were out there doing something and then we were supposed to get a like take a picture and they're like all right everyone go climb on the on, on the rope pyramid oh it gets fruity hold on <laughs> everyone go climb on the rope pyramid what? What? listen listen what? it's funny but like i <laughs> don't say that and grab me <laughs> okay so everyone they're like all right everyone go, go climb on there and make sure you're visible so everyone runs and jumps on like all the spots are taken because it's pretty full and you already got people up top like putting their hands up so yeah like, yeah yeah what do I do? So I jump and I lay in front. I lay down in front and I like oh, put up no. that one. You know that one. Pose? You, always have, you always have that one kid. Bro. That <laughs> always got that kid. I don't know why I did it. I just did. I regret it. But I sat there and I put, you know put my elbow on the yeah, dirt. Yeah. I was like on my side of my head and then put my one knee up yeah. and the other one straight. And I sit there and I sat there and pose. No one noticed. I took the picture. It's like a week later. Everyone was looking at the picture and they're like. What is Devin doing? <laughs> and, the, and the teacher was like, I guess we have like our class model. And everyone starts laughing. Oh, I was laughing too. I'm like, right. I don't think these guys are laughing with me. <laughs> <laughs> They're laughing. I don't know. Me. It was kind of funny. But at the same time, it was like just a dumb decision. I was watching. I was looking at my Snapchat memories like a week ago, maybe two weeks ago. And it was uh, like a week or two after you. We both had our cars. We both had our license. And we drove over for no reason other than just to go over and hang out at the the new park that they built mm -hmm. and they had one they have one over there they have a pyramid over there and i have it on my phone where we just out of nowhere just like all right let's race up to the top but we have to record well i don't want to record you record to see who wins oh right, yeah we, we, we held we the see. phones and we raced up that's actually kind of cool did it yeah. work oh, out it was uh, like a cool pov bro i mean jacob won but i only had one hand going up yeah Didn't you dude. both I no, I smoked no, this kid. I recorded, so I had it in my hand the whole time. I oh, this kid. I thought you each were recording yourselves. No, I was, nah, recording. was recording us both, bro. Oh, that's yeah, I had that's to record you both of us. You each should have like recorded yeah. yourselves going uh, up, racing. Not, not to like showboat or anything, but I was able to get up that thing in like two seconds. Well, yeah, you had all four limbs. No, I would run. You know, like the lowest one with the most bounce. Oh yeah, trampoline yeah, yeah, hop on that. that. I mean, it's so. I might go up to the new park and do it sometime and get a video. I got, I got one hand, so I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying, bro. He had a you no. Know, you have your phone out too. I just saw it. I have you probably to. might have took it at the top. But yeah, that lowest bungee, dude. You send yourself yeah. all the way like three quarters <laughs> up. It is awesome. Yeah, because that one's been oh, at the time it was brand new. Yeah, but then you're really flying in midair and you have you have like a you know a bungee, a cord to land both feet on. And if they both go opposite sides, bro, you know what's happening. Your nuts are gone. <laughs> yeah, <it's funny>. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye, kiddos, grandkids. <laughs> Nah, bro. Lineage stops here. <laughs> oh yeah, it's dangerous, bro. Oh man, good times, bro. The only other like physical activity time getting hurt in school was freshman year gym class, bro. Girl in my grade playing capture the flag. She rocked me in the face, bro. Like full fist to face, just rocked me in the face. Dude, that that might be the hardest with punch. Noses. Yeah, I got a bloody nose. That used to be. That was probably the hardest punch I ever taken in my whole life. <laughs> I got Rocked. her. Don't worry. Dude, the funniest thing, yeah, as, I got terrible, her back the next day. <laughs> as terrible it sounds, is to watch other people in your class, like in elementary school, get hurt. It was, did you not enjoy that? You like doing that? Or no, uh, yes, yeah, so uh, watch, like, like watching, not me hurting like them. A, like, like a third person someone. spectator? Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm not going to lie, climbing, dude. And they slip, they just no, fall, bro. and they slam the ground and start <laughs> crying. There was this, uh, <laughs> bro, they had me in tears. <laughs> there was this they horribly placed, uh, there was this horribly placed, uh, like, arched bar, right, that went up to, like, five feet, like this. So it was, like, this tall. 
and you guys know Lane. He's we're oh. playing football one day. He's running under this sucker, scrapes his head. But I mean, cuts that sucker open. Blood's like squirting everywhere. <laughs> the teacher has to run up and like put cloth on it. I mean, it was a bad injury. He had to get like six stitches. Was, and I remember uh, seeing it was that. Spurting, bro. And this was like halfway through recess, and we were we were like, bros, I well, we should take the rest of the day off this football. I mean, that was pretty graphic. I mean, yeah, <laughs> that, that I would take off. But like it when people bad, just dude. like fall from the ground from like four or five feet up and they get the wind knocked out and they're just like <laughs> and you're just like <laughs> I was dying bro I don't I suppose watching. there were a few times where like someone went for a layup and then went <laughs> and it was kind of funny there's definitely watch. times in football when like just a harmless you see someone get like pancake blocked or something but like you made like it was like a defense play and they had like a two yard run but you just see one of your linebackers get pancaked and you're like oh my god bro you guys had like linebackers and stuff bro no no i'm talking talking like football irl bro oh yeah like high school oh yeah (laughs) yeah. i was sitting there i'm like dang you elementary kids were set up (laughs) no dude we were we were running the four three four bro yeah complete coverage no, but yeah, it always is funny. Like especially in the games, it don't matter. Like the JV games, if you watch a friend get absolutely destroyed, you sit there and stare at them, and you just go <laughs> and shake your head. <laughs> yeah. Even or, if you didn't oh, do anything, I don't like, know how this happens so often. But like that one kid that would like get open in the corner of the end zone, but he couldn't catch, and the quarterback would throw him the ball, go right through his hands, hit him in the nuts, and he would just <laughs> drop on the ground. I swear, I saw that like every month, dude. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> oh my. Oh man. That's funny. What other stories have I got? I I had one, but I forget. <coughs> I have one that's. It's only funny at the end. I it's had another, a story once. <laughs> <laughs> it's only funny at the end, bro. But it was a uh, second grade. First and second grade teachers didn't like me too much. Now I think about it. But um, we've had Evan Island on on this pod once. Shouts out to the man. Uh, there was one time. You know how? Okay, so you know how like. For, to pe- teachers to like randomly pick somebody for anything, they have like the popsicle sticks with the names on it. Yeah, they put it yeah. in a mug, you know, you and, like, and, and you pull the pull mug out. out. Right. So, this particular mug said like best teacher in the world or something like that. Like one of those like classic cliche ones, you know. Dude, school sucked. Like that stuff was just normal. Like what? It is weird. I like we were just used to that stuff, but go yeah. Ahead. But, um, so one time we were lining up literally to go out to recess, like to go out to recess. We were lining up and her like, teaching cart was there and the mug was there i was standing next to evan and we were both like just kind of like i wasn't touching nothing he wasn't touching nothing at first either and we were just like looking I'm like oh there's my name I'm like she spelled it wrong what the hell and i was like oh there's mine and i don't know what compelled this man he went found it pulled his up but he pulled his and like 20 others up somehow with it like they were all <laughs> stuck and the mug flipped up and i'm like oh god so i try to put my hand like i try to like put it back down but like we both had like a different uh, like vision of how we would save this thing, and it dude it just crashed to the ground and the, oh. the mug exploded, and it was just a bad time. And we dude, were just if sitting I was there. Smart enough, I would have definitely took my name out of that <laughs> <laughs> and just like every day threw it away. <laughs> <laughs> but we were just sitting there staring at it like everyone was looking like it got so quiet because it just heard a mug crash, yeah. and so like we were just Evan and I were just staring at it like, oh god, what and then she like she like looked up our teacher looked up and she's like. Wanted to stare at it, pick it up. And we're like, all right. That could like, be a worse reaction. I'm thinking it. like, God damn it, Evan. So, all right, all right, let's pick this shit up. And it's like five minutes on the wall at least. Start picking it up. And then picked up all the sticks. Evan, well, Evan picked up like all the sticks. I picked up two and gave them to him. And he's like, all right, see you, Isaiah. I'm like, what are you, what are you talking about? So I got to pick up all of the mug shards. The teacher's already gone. I'm like, all right. She's like out the hallway, like waiting for me. So I'm going to start picking them up and I'm picking some up. And I picked up a sharp one and it cut my finger like all the way down. Oh, yeah. I definitely want to slice the hell out of my Oh, God. So I keep picking them up. So I want to go out to recess. So I, I finally got them all. I put them in the trash can. I'm like, all right, I'm done. Um, I heard, like, can I get like a bandage? She's like, let's just go out to recess. I'm like, what are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, you let's go out to recess. I'm oh, like, all right, I got to use the bathroom first. And she's like, <laughs> why, the, why the fuck did I become a teacher? <laughs> All right, go on. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Kids. <laughs> so I'm, I'm Die, I don't care. And so I get out, and she's already out there. Like, she's not even, she didn't even wait for me. So she's already out there. So I'm like, all right. So I, <laughs> I go back into the bathroom and I wrap my <laughs> finger with toilet paper <laughs> and I walk out the reasons. I'm like, let's play, boys. And I, I'm out there and it was <laughs> like, I couldn't even close my hand. It was so wide. It was this middle one, 
and it was the pay- it was it was bleeding like crazy. So even like the outside was like kind of mushy, like you squeeze enough, some mm-hmm. blood would come out. And it was so I just kept wrapping and kept wrapping and kept wrapping. And I had some. I remember I had some in my pocket to like replace it <laughs> for like the twenty minutes I was outside. And I remember like this will be fine. And then we went to lunch. And I just went to the office. I got a little like a bandaid on it. And the lady's like, "This is like matted and like dried." Our uh, the school nurse. She's like, "This is matted and dried." Like, what? How long have you been just dealing with this? I'm like, oh, I wanted to go play. I'm like, okay. <laughs> So I gave her like, <laughs> she's like, well, "What did you use to cover it?" And I reach into my pocket and I pull a full thing of like bloody, <laughs> bloody toilet paper and tissue Gosh. paper. And I'm like, "I don't know what you want to do with this," but she's like, "Put it, just, just give it to me." So I give it to her. The school nurse was my great aunt, and you know how like it's like cool yeah. to see your relatives when you're younger. <laughs> so I would just walk into the nervous office sometimes. She's like, "Jacob, you need anything?" I'm like. Nope, just wanted to say hi, guys. <laughs> hi, how are you doing? Oh, I'm doing good, Jacob. <laughs> All right, I'll see you later. Right. My friend's in there. Congratulations. Congratulations. No, one time in second grade, bro, I was putting this stuff out for weeks. You know how you know how teachers always had made you write your name on the board? Yeah, dude, that was embarrassing. The wall and they shame. Ma- they made you they like had like things over it. Like they always had like stuff on their whiteboard, right? Like this big <laughs> sleeve that could hold calculators and stuff. Yeah. So I'm like, bro, I'm so smart. How to write my name on the board? I lift up this thing. Nice. I write my name under it. Genius. I put it down, and then we're going to recess that day. And she reads off all the names, all the people that have the stand on the wall, and she doesn't like remember me having to put my name up there, and doesn't notice me. So, but everyone else in the class was like, you know, like oh, the other kids that had a stand on the wall. They're like, bro, Jacob, you That's dirty dog, genius, you got away with man. one, and I just got to play. <laughs> Until <laughs> did, did, did the thing never move? Like no, did the no, calculator was, sleeve like never move? Yeah, did you just like, like erase it one time or? Yeah, just went in there and erased it sometime. That's and sweet. I'm like, dude. bro, I'm him. <laughs> that is sweet. I remember one time it wasn't. I didn't. It, I didn't involve me in any way, shape, or form. But it was still hilarious, dude. So you might have had. A, I think you had a similar experience. But uh, someone was misbehaving in like a fifth grade social studies class. And I did not like this teacher at all, and I don't think she liked anybody with a Y chromosome. But uh, somebody, we were working in groups, and she said, like, all right, guys, we're going to center up, like, as a class again and get back to our seats. And one group was not paying attention at all, and it was right next to us. So it was, like, my group of three people talking to, like, another group of three. So it's six people total that could have been targeted, and there's three guys in it. So there's a 33% chance one of us gets domed by what's coming next, and we're not paying She's attention at all. Not paying attention. Oh, yeah, dude. There's no shot. She, Yeah. Not paying attention at all. But it's like 30 seconds. Like, she didn't say th- anything again. She didn't say, like, come on, all right. Didn't walk up to us. She was like, <sighs> takes, like, an expo marker in her hand. She's like, I'm feeling lethal today. <sighs> Zing. And, oh, my God, it's a straight laser at this poor kid's head. And it, like, slams him, like, the teacher. It slams him like right here. Oh, yeah. I ain't taking that. <laughs> me, me personally, right I here. Ain't taking that. And he goes, Pff. "Oh, dude!" <laughs> and like the whole class, is like, what the fuck? and he said it to the like he knew who threw it too. He's like, "Oh, dude!" And she's like, "Don't, dude, me." And he goes, "You <laughs> did it. <laughs> you just assaulted me." <laughs> and he's yeah, he was always one of the guys. that's like, yeah, I'm already in trouble, <laughs> so might as well. So he was. It was a fun back and forth. I remember, like, I, I can't do it in this chair, but I was, like, throughout the whole conversation, anytime someone got louder than the other, like a yelling match, I'll, like, take the opportunity to scooch my chair back in case something else happened. It's, like, <laughs> exiting the premises. Yeah. Work well, yourself out. Now to the epicenter of the earthquake. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, we had, a, we had an old substitute teacher one time in, like, fifth grade come in. And he takes one of those expo markers. <laughs> <laughs> he starts writing out a question on the smart board. <laughs> like, it's like a TV screen. And all of us are just, like, <laughs> looking at each other like, oh, I, I thought it ain't right. I love those substitutes who don't really know what they're doing. We, like, <laughs> we let him finish, bro. And then one of the girls is like, yeah, you're not supposed to write on that. <laughs> and he's like, oh, no. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> you told me a hilarious story. Was it Evan? I don't want to get it wrong. I have a story about that. Yeah, day. I know exactly what you're talking yeah, about, funny. Mrs. With Mrs. Bubbleman mm. in their English class. Yes. <laughs> I was no, so it was Goldschmidt. Yes. So they're sitting there. No, no, no. no. This was 
uh, Evan L, who's been on the pod. I don't think you guys have heard this story. I think he told it to me at work one day. All right, go oh. ahead. Give it to us, dude. Was, Give it to was, us. She was teaching the calculus class, right? And no, it was, this it was, is it this was is a Bowman, tribe time. Bro. It was like, no, 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 no. Yeah, it's Bowman. Calculus, bro. Think. Unless you're telling a whole different it's story. Math. Calculus. It's a, I think it's a different okay, story. Yeah, it's, it must be a different story than the Get one up, I heard. Get out the popcorn, Jake. We haven't heard this before. So I'm pretty sure it was like, no, it was ACT prep. It was ACT prep. It was ACT prep. Yeah, it was Bowman class. What are you talking about? Anyway, I'm going to continue with this story. Maybe here. you did hear this, but I didn't think it was... Whatever. So she she's sitting there, and like apparently she already had a kind of a long, stressful day. <laughs> she was doing... I was, I'm sorry. Bro, I can tell this story better, because no, I actually no, no, know no. whose class oh, it was. Oh, Let's do it. Devin's a better storyteller than both of us are. Let's be honest here. Hey, I'll take it. Anyway, so they're, they're just sitting there. We win these. She's sitting there during tribe time, right? And doing ACT prep, which is like extra. If you want to go, you can to help and prepare for I your ACT. And so there was an Elmo, right? Everyone knows an Elmo one where it would pick up what the piece of paper is and project it on the mm-hmm. screen. Well, she forgot to turn the screen on. <laughs> so she was just writing on the Elmo, <laughs> asking questions and answering. And apparently people started <laughs> shouting answers. So she didn't know the screen was on. <laughs> She's like, all right, guys, what's the answer no. to this one? And someone was just like, see, even though none of them could see. <laughs> none of them have no idea what's going on. She's like, mm, no, that's not right, guys. That makes no sense. She and Evan said they, she did this for like the whole entire tribe time. 30 minutes, like seven. Probably. Away. Like seven questions or eight questions until she finally turned and realized, like, uh, wait, <laughs> th- the screen wasn't on? Was none of you going to tell me? I was taking time out of my day to help you guys, and everyone starts dying. No, it was, it was <laughs> Puppleman because she almost cried. Yeah, that, maybe it was. Maybe yeah, it, it was. Because Miss Goldschmidt would just be yeah, like, oh, yeah, I'm yeah, blonde. Yeah, yes, yes, <laughs> yes, 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 she would definitely do You're that. right. It but was no, yeah. be a little too much coffee today. He, he said she was like, was like on the verge of tears, it, like, I took was. time out of my day. I don't have to do this, guys. <laughs> yeah. I don't have to do this. <laughs> it was English AC deep prep. <laughs> so, I'm just oh, I'm wondering, who was the menace that just started yelling out answers instead oh. of like, normal people would just be like, yo, we can't see it. I wouldn't have been able to control myself, dude. I'm just like sitting there. And someone's, and someone's like, like, yo, it's B. <laughs> yeah. I would have lost it. I would have lost it. Because you know everyone else is already looking at each other like confused, like, we can't see it. Does everyone know what's going on? And someone's just like, then one pioneer hey. absolute trailblazer. Yeah. Exactly. Until she, she, she remembers that first person that yelled out one and be like, it was yeah. you. <laughs> it just started the chain. Because once one person did it, like, all right, that's what oh, we're doing man. now. We'll, we'll, we'll keep with it. That's so amazing. funny. Yeah, yeah. Evan told me that in the hot tub on freaking. Mm. Oh really? On Friday, that's where dude. it was. That's and where it I was. was crying. Yeah, I was in there with it. it was I was hilarious. remember I was falling over so people. Funny. I remember I could not breathe because oh, I was laughing yeah. so hard. It was so good when he when he told the the part about them just yelling out random answers. Yeah, bro. I'm like, bro, the person that started that is going is going places. Like that that's just such a genius yeah, move. So funny. <laughs> like it's not it sucks because it's not gonna help you with the ACT, obviously. But that is hilarious. Yeah, well, what does that matter? Anyways. I remember in our. Uh, <laughs> Was I no mean, like, yeah. Me? I mean, she might have gotten a 35 on your ACT, but I can bench two plates, so <laughs> I don't care. He's really winning. Yeah, he's really winning. Yeah. Um, you're in the top, like, 10%. Per- no, probably not. You're probably a little higher than that. 35 would be, like, you're in the top, like, 4%. I'm the top one. Okay. You and me, we're not the same. <laughs> I have, I have two super awkward cringe stories that happened to me in elementary, and they're both with the same person. And yes. I'm not going to say Oh, come on. I'll, I'll tell you guys I'm off camera, but right. not on camera. Right. I told you I shat myself. <laughs> yeah. Right. Check out last episode. Come on. Hey, man, that's just clutching up, bro. That Can you help me change my name? I told, the, I told the story about me being a fruity model. <laughs> that's not so bad. That's not, that's not so bad. You got to tell one to that level. Come on. We come had on. these. We had, <laughs> we had these. Uh, this is completely different, but oh, we, come on. we had these uh, like nice thing dailies. You had to like put in like buckets or something. I don't know. I did a horrible job explaining that, but pretty much you had to oh, write. Yeah, 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 you had yeah, to write yeah. a compliment about someone and put it in their bucket what every day. Call those like a nice thing daily or something. Yeah, I have no idea. Daily of compliment. Yeah, yeah, bucket of kindness. We had, like we had to do one like once a week, bro. I never did bro. that. But and I, I was like, I, I was like, ain't no way, dude. So every week I'd write the same thing nice. to Luke Meyer. <laughs> every single week. <laughs> and every Friday he would come up to me like, 
Thanks, Sharon. <laughs> what was it? What was it? It was like, you look really good today or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> it was so weird. I knew it was something not normal. Did you have to write like, one oh. to everyone in the class or just no, pick no, one? Once a week, bro. But like people would go like sweat stain like and write like 50, you know? Oh, spend yeah, like a whole free period. Crazy. That's why I hated mine, bro. I like, never got one, bro. I did not talk to these. I didn't get one until like I two think, weeks in. I think when I, Luke Meyer just started putting one in mine. Yeah, <laughs> stay, stay, stay. I think I think I got a good amount every week because I was like one of like the quieter ones, but I wasn't like weird. You know, like I didn't have a reason to be quiet or that awkward. Quiet kid in school. I was just quiet and awkward. Although <laughs> there was one time in fifth grade, bro. <laughs> I just remember this dude. I had not thought about this. Ex- I, I had not thought about this since the day it happened. Uh, I'll tell you guys who it was afterwards, but I don't want to say her name, obviously. Um, we were talking one time, like just like at our table, like in class, and she goes, we "We're talking about money or something like that, like as like uh, the lesson of the day." And this one one girl goes up to me, and she goes, "Wait, I said, so are you like poor?" <laughs> I'm like, oh. <laughs> and I go, I go, Yo. N- yes, <laughs> no, and she goes, oh. Oh, I'm really sorry. I'm like, no, it's okay. <laughs> and she's like, I just thought, like, because, like, the clothes you wear. And I'm like, <laughs> this is my style now? Oh, no. I did not have style, bro. I, I basically went to school in, like, what I'm wearing now, except, like, these would be, like, blue shorts, bro. Oh, I did no, not you care talk about, about weird, color. Kid, red, until fifth grade, I never wore shorts, only pants. 100 degrees outside, <laughs> I'm wearing pants to school. Why? I only wore sweatpants, bro. Why? I don't know. I don't know, bro. Ah, uh, man. I don't, but I just... Like, I was weird. I don't know. That's, <laughs> that might be the one thing that was suppressed in my head. I had that like, type of... Our, sorry, wait. Are you poor? I had that same I experience. So. I, I worked the cafeteria lunch line, so I'd, like, dish out things, oh, like, yeah, yeah. during other lunch periods. I always applied for that number, got <laughs> Yeah, they didn't trust me. Probably for good reason, bro. <laughs> they didn't trust the poor man with food. Yeah. <laughs> he thought he would steal it, take yeah. it all back. <laughs> but, uh... <laughs> <laughs> but I was with three girls, and like the first day, it was kind of awkward. Like nice. we we ate at different I times. I remember a story about this, but and it was three gals, and then one day they just started asking me questions, like about being a guy and stuff, like just random questions. I was just answering these things off. I'm like, God, that was the weirdest thing that ever happened mm-hmm. to me. Oh, we we got to wrap this one up. We got a little bit of time if you have anything else. I um, felt like I just had something. Oh, but I, I just remember. Oh, I got a lot more, bro. I, just, I haven't even told the best one yet. <laughs> <laughs> Say it, bro. We ain't got enough time for this. All right, all right. I do remember. <laughs> Are we going to do three episodes of this stuff? Oh, oh, we might yeah. as well. Let's do it. All right. Right. Do you get- remember AP Physics, Sherm? Just that whole class. No, not one specific instance. No, dude. I deleted that from memory, bro. What? Copy, paste. <laughs> I loved that class, dude. And I was the worst one at it, too. I'm sure that was in. I was the worst one in that hurt. class the whole time. And I, I loved it, dude. Just like every day looking over at Jake and Tristan. Like, it'll be a normal class we'll be reviewing for like a really important test the next day. And I'll be like, this studio's Jake will be like highlighting stuff. The only two girls in the entire class would just be going to town, like going sweat. And then we had one guy in front of us, two guys over to the side. And I'd be, I'd be trying my damnest to like focus up. And I'd look over to my right because I'd hear, like, I'd sense movement. And I'd see, here, hold, hold this. I'd see, uh, Jake, like the smartest in the class, easily. Like, dude didn't have to try anything. He'd be going, standing up, no one, like the teacher's not looking up at him. So this is why. He'd just be going. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Everyone yeah. hit the gap. Though, the it was, class, was like, hilarious. Uh, for no reason. There'd be no one talking. Yeah, remember that time I literally just stayed, like sprayed like a quarter cup of water on you? <laughs> yes. Like, you know those dis- the, the distilled water cup, like the, the squirt that things? Yeah, water. And he'd t- take it and he'd go, <laughs> And then I'd pick it up like, son of a, Jacob, God. And then, I, like, I'd have it in my hand, and then she'd hear someone complain. She'd go, yeah. I say, uh, what do you mean? So one time, bro, I put, I put an absolute lake on this man's chair. He sits down, he looks at me, he's like, why is my butt wet right dude, now? Dude, do you remember, do you remember me turning, so she had a central, she had a central countertop with sinks on it, but she used it as a desktop, like a secondary desktop in front of the class. She had, in, in the sink, she had, she had a ton of papers and so important papers. documents. <laughs> like, great attention, you need to put it. Say, it's not, we're doing like a thing up there, he's I not mean, paying attention, he's like, turns the water on. 
house. <laughs> and that is that like jet faucet. I close it. Right, I'm like, we can fix this. We can fix this. <laughs> Bell rings. Everyone leaves. And I'm, sh- I'm the only one left in there. She doesn't know I'm in there. Her bag is turned. I'm like, oh, shit. God damn it. So I'm like flipping them up, drying them, drying them, drying them. I like take everything out of the sink. I couldn't turn the sink off because <laughs> the thing hadn't been turned on in so long. It was like, uh, it was like rusted, stuck. I don't know what that noise was, but we're at that time. Oh, okay. We're we're close though. I'll turn it off. And remember, ladies and gentlemen. What's funny? You joined the darkness. I was born in it. It was merely adopted, but you know, he's. You were merely adopted just keep by the darkness. I don't know. You get. I just couldn't Star Wars. I'm more of a Harry Potter fan, but whatever. Let's, but just, guys, 